Hello everybody. Merry Christmas and Happy Holidays and Happy New Year and all that good stuff. Hey, I think it's about time for a beer. Let's go see what's in the fridge today. Hey guys, thanks for talking about Greg's Beer Reviews today. Today's beer comes from Boonville, Anderson Valley Brewing Company. Happy Holidays everybody. Merry Christmas. This should be a good beer. I sure hope it is. Uh, I've not been disappointed from anything. It says gold medal winner right on the label here. Uh, anything from these guys. Uh, let, me, uh, let me read what's on the back. Each year when people are starting to unpack their winter clothes and replenish their firewood, our tiny brewery and coastal... Redwoods of Northern California make seasonal preparations of a different kind. As the cold arrives, we release a unique beverage created to add warmth to even the coldest and darkest of winter's days, winter solstice seasonal. It all begins with a very high original gravity to create a hearty and spicy brew with a deep amber hue and a smooth finish. Anderson Valley Brewing Company wishes you the very best for the holiday season and the new year. And so do I. To all 3,500 of my subscribers, uh, I do appreciate it. I am humbled. And let's get on with the show. Very nice. This uh, comes from Anderson Valley, and they're out of California. This is a winter warmer coming in at 6.90 ADV, so it's almost 7%. Pretty, pretty impressive number there. Uh, winter beer, they, uh, they do this, uh, I guess, every winter. Uh, this is the first time I've had this one. The food pairings is uh, the meats, poultry, and game. And glassware, pint, Becker Stein, oversized wine. I've got the Dubell glass, guys. It's over 7%. Well, right at 7 Close enough to me. I could have put it in a pint glass, but uh, the darker beer, too. So we're going we're gonna to put it in this glass today. And um, it's uh, it's 7%. Unless it's got some kind of super hoppy characteristics, but I don't think it does. Uh, you can you can sell this for a little while, but if you're going to do it again next winter, I wouldn't sell it too long. So, guys... Get the cap off the thing, see what we got. Let's go down the center. They were talking, I thought it was going to be real super dark. It's not that dark. Alright guys, it's over to the light. It is a bronze copper color. It is uh, very clear in the... Uh, there is no haze or any kind of cloudiness to that beer. Uh, I'm going it as a filtered beer, guys. It looks very good in the glass. I didn't pour a very big head. I didn't pour it super aggressive, but it is what it is. A lot of bubbles streaming up in there. A lot of small bubbles, too. So, let's get a nose on it. I'm getting like vanilla and dark fruit. Maybe a little cinnamon maybe. Or allspice or something like that. A little spiciness going on there. A little bit of a roasty malt there too. Oh, it smells very delicious. Cheers guys. Happy holidays again. Oh wow. Oh wow, that's very pleasant. A nice, sweet, spicy, vanilla -y. Wow. Wow. That is delicious. That might be the best winter warmer I think I've ever had. The winter solstice on the winter solstice. Wow. That's delicious, guys. Wow, wow, wow. I am super impressed. A lot going on with this beer. A lot of taste going on. Very, very pleasant. Very sessionable. No, no trace of the alcohol as far as I'm concerned. Wow. I'm blown away. You can't see it because I got a hat on. My hair is blown back. Nice. Very nice. This is definitely an A, guys. Let's see if this gets a 10. Stick around. I'll be right back. All right, guys. Thanks for sticking around. I've got just a little left in the glass. This is pretty damn tasty. 
Probably one of the better winter warmers I've ever had. Got a nice, sweet, roasty malt taste of this, but go along with the vanilla and everything going on. Well, it's pretty tasty. Bow the guys. Wow. Guys, it's a nine. I'm going to give it a nine on the scale. Pretty damn impressive. One of the better, one of the best winter warmer ales I've had. Got a lot of nice, got a lot of nice notes with this that come together that blend well so very tasty beer uh, if you see this pick it up give it a try uh rate beer has 92 overall and 96 in the style so they, they were pretty blown away there too and beer advocate comes up with the 87 on their scale so as i told you yesterday on this uh, on these ratings that they're changing over to they're just going to confuse people more with this with new rates as far as i'm concerned guys so, uh, I think it's an, it's an A beer, and I'm going to give it that. It's a 9 on a scale of 10. Pick it up, give it a try, guys. As always, rate, comment, subscribe. Happy holidays, guys. Come on back tomorrow. We're going to look in the fridge. See everybody then.